In this video, the Teach to Learn Foundation will help you solve algebraic equations that involve negative numbers. We're going to start with an easy problem. In this question, you have negative 2x is equal to negative 8. So first, because you want to isolate the x, you divide by negative 2 on both sides. That leaves you with x is equal to, and here's where the negative numbers come in play, a negative divided by a negative is a positive, so you have x is equal to 4. That was fairly straightforward. Let's try a little bit harder. This question involves negative 4x plus 7 equals to 15. So again, we want to isolate the x, so we subtract 7, which leaves us with negative 4x is equal to 15 minus 7, which is 8. And then you divide by negative 4. And here, a positive divided by a negative is a negative, so you have negative 2. And we'll do one more problem. This question is very complex. The first thing you want to do with these is uh, distribute the negative 2 because of the parentheses. So you have negative 2 times x which is negative 2x, and then you have negative 2 times negative 6, which leaves you with positive, because negative times negative is a positive, 12, plus 5x equal to negative 18. The next step is to combine like terms, so you have negative 2x and 5x, and because it's a negative 2x, when you combine that with 5x, you're left with 3x plus 12 is equal to negative 18. Now you're going to subtract 12 from both sides, which leaves you with 3x is equal to, and negative 18 minus 12, you have to imagine you're going backwards, so you have actually negative 30 and not 6. Then you divide by 3, and a negative divided by a positive is a negative, so you have x is equal to negative 10. Hopefully that helps you figure out how to deal with negatives in your equations. If you have any other questions, please submit them through the comments or email us at info at t2lusa.me.